as a person that creates content, aka me, it's a bit interesting because every single time a month passes already and I'm like, what? Bro, I posted a month ago. What the frick? I feel like I just posted a video like a week ago. No, it's been a month again. Plenty of projects in the works and there's stuff I'm always doing. And I've just, I've been in a weird rut recently because it's like I, I went to Nebraska because Lauren graduated. So now she's home and I'm very happy about that. And to be honest, I've been spending a lot of time with her because that's important for me and her and our relationship. And so it's just like, been focusing on that a lot lately and it's made me realize like and the dumb thing is right i literally have a script to the next video right here that i wrote a few days ago and i was gonna shoot it like today or yesterday and that never happened because i've been super busy and it's not even like a big video it's just like a it it's the fourth annual youtubers i'm thankful for video and i'm debating on making that or not because i'm just kind of sitting here like well part of me wants to work on a shorter video because i'm not feeling videos uh right now which kind of sucks but not really because i've been really been learning music a lot more been trying to up my production because i'm not gonna lie i think my music isn't the best right now and that sucks also because i've made two albums and i feel like i've gotten to this point where i'm like i'm still not happy with my music because something just sounds off with it i don't even know recording this video gives me an excuse to uh try out this new standing setup for uh, because i want to <laughs> and also i didn't want to move the webcam off the tripod because my camera that's my tr camera tripod that it's on i've just been feeling in a weird rut recently and uh so that's fun <laughs> not really i've been working on music a lot more often which is cool i've been working on a three song ep which will be my last musical project for a very long time because i think after the ep is done Personally, I would like to disappear from the internet for like four months. Not even an exaggeration. Like I'll probably still stream for the sake of my community, but I probably won't be super active on like the main channel or uh, in general on the internet. I won't try to be because there is a very specific project I've been working on for an entire year almost at this point. And it's kind of gotten to the point where it's like it, it got corrupted a little bit. So I'm sitting here like, oh, of course, the one important part of the big project gets corrupted and then I feel unmotivated to do anything about it. But I figured out a new way to tackle it. So, uh, and I haven't done that yet. Um, so that's fun. But that will be a project that will happen hoping for September, which means probably not going to upload on the main channel until September, to be honest, uh, because this big project I've been working on for a while I keep pushing it back because I keep making these shorter form videos like the Josh Fry video, which I wasn't even planning on doing. I just did. So that might be the last video on the main channel for a while because I've been working on something super big that I've never done before. Plus, if I go away for a lot of months and then also it's like, oh, then people will want to watch a very long video from me, I think. Um, I just don't want to have to keep pushing because the problem is like time keeps moving faster and faster because I feel like that. I keep moving faster in my life because like I'm going to get married later this year, you know, and that's a big thing that's happening in my life in October, October 9th, I'm getting married this year. And that's been a big thing. Um, for sure. I should probably not do that because <laughs> of noise. So I've been focusing on Lauren a lot because she's home and that's cool and all, but I've also filled this weird creative rut because I feel split between like music and videos and i haven't been feeling videos i've been feeling music a lot recently and i love writing music i love making music i just figured out a way to increase my production with music which i think makes it sound way better but yeah uh once the three song ep drops hopefully uh soon <laughs> I'm, I'm not gonna lie. i've been in a creative rut all day today so th this is why this is recording now because i'm like i'm so sick and tired of doing nothing today I've literally just been watching youtube all day and i that sucks and i don't like that but the big project it's a bit different from what i've been making now but i think the transition will be smoother because it's more genuine content and i've been going towards more genuine content on my main channel in general because i feel like for the longest of time i felt too scripted and i felt not as genuine as i wanted to be because 
I was trying to say every single word on a script correctly instead of talking genuinely person to person, which I've been trying to do a lot more because I think people appreciate that more because I'm not, there's no script here. I'm literally just talking and that's fun. But I've been trying to do more stuff like that, not trying to script out every single word, I'm trying to do more bullet point stuff so I have at least a structure, um, which has helped. And I think, I don't know, I think it's been good for the most part. But yeah, I know the trip in general to Nebraska, what, two weeks ago, something like that. It was really fun. Um, and I enjoyed it a lot. And it was good for me. It was good to actually hang out with Lauren and help her like move from college and stuff. And so I've just been busy with personal stuff with like that. Um, been hanging out with Lauren a lot because I need it. Long distance relationship sucks and it's no longer a long distance relationship. So I'm a happier person <laughs> because of that as well. So that's nice. So I'm just trying to get used to the work cycle because I haven't had a lot of client work either recently. So it's been a little slow, which is fine for me because that means I get more time off and more time to actually chill and rest because I feel like I don't do that a whole often because I'm a workhorse. But so that's been kind of nice a little bit. That was today because yesterday I was spending basically all day with Lauren and my family and her family. And so today I was my brain was just like, oh, you're dead because apparently I'm an introvert. So that means if I spend all day with people, apparently uh, it takes a lot of mental process for me. So, yeah. So I've been taking today to just kind of chill and it's been kind of nice, but I just don't like not creating. It feels weird when I don't create something for a while and I haven't. I really haven't gotten to create anything in a long time. I feel, especially with the main channel video, I am alive. I'm busy. Um, I'm doing good uh, mentally, everything like that. That's really good. But what I'm saying is don't expect content from me for a long time because I've gotten to this point where I kind of need to focus on the big project because it's it's an important one for me. I'm not going to lie. Um, and I part of me wishes I didn't start it because I'm kind of in a rabbit hole now where I'm like, well, I can't stop at this point. I could, but. I would lose so much time if I were to stop this project. Now I don't want to do that. But yeah, I, and the thing is I can't say anything about the project because I'm so, there's the other thing about me, right? Like I don't want people to know what I'm working on because I like to surprise people. And also I got to give the patrons something, right? I need, I need to give them an edge of some sort because they're literally giving me money. So they're going to have, they already know what's happening. They're going to get a bunch of updates. Also, exclusive content has been happening on Patreon every so often because I feel bad uh, when I don't post on the main channel for a long time. Like it happens every time. Um, it's just about work-life balance, you know what I mean? Because it's like I could just upload weekly videos like I did a while ago, but my work-life balance was really suffering because of that and uh, was not good. Uh, so yeah, even though I've made one of my biggest videos this year uh, because of that week. So, <laughs> so that felt weird. Um, the box assassin video, but actually I literally have the, uh, a box assassin t-shirt in my, you know what? No, we're just gonna grab it <laughs> literally right here, which if I would have known this was a thing, this would have been in the video, but it wasn't, I guess my main point is I think with any content creator, because I have these bouts where I'm like, oh, this content creator hasn't posted in so long. Everybody is living their life. And just because somebody doesn't post for a long time doesn't mean they're dead or whatever. Just means that sometimes you got to prioritize other things in your life rather than just creation. Because I don't think people realize how draining content creation can be when you've done it for so long. And so the, to step away from it for a little bit and then to come back is helpful, but also not for me personally, because I feel like I'm gotten out of the rut of creation Besides like music occasionally, but even still, I feel like I've been weirdly floating ever since the trip, which is kind of bad because it's like, yeah, I've had some time off from creation, but now I've gotten to a point where I'm like, okay, we gotta, we gotta be productive. We gotta work on something. I think toxic productivity is probably a thing that I uh, <laughs> suffer from. So toxic productivity is not a good thing thing even though I tend to fall into that I think work-life balance is always important 
and it's good to focus on that no matter who you are hopefully soon i'll drop a new ep and some new music and then after that i will probably go dark for a very long time unless you're on my discord server and unless uh you watch the streams because i'm still gonna do weekly streams because that's the other thing i feel like it hasn't been like a month since i've uploaded because i've been doing weekly streams i've actually been streaming twice a week now fridays and saturdays fridays are solo stream saturdays are discord stream and i like that i think it's a lot of fun to do in general um but i stream at least once a week on youtube on this channel actually wow surprising but yeah i don't know if i'll work on the shorter video or not i'm leaning towards not now because it's just i i see the cycle you know where it's like oh i got a big project oh let's work on this little project it takes a month and so then i lose a month on the bigger project and that's it's it just keeps happening so i've set a deadline september that's when the big project's going to get done i don't care at that point that's when i don't know exact date but like i'm saying september because the wedding's in october so i'm like i want to get this project done before the wedding because it is very much i don't want to say a product of its time but it's like it's it's i feel like it's this weird time capsule for me so if it goes over past october i feel like it would muddy the genuineness of it in a weird way for me personally so i kind of want to get it done this year because i started it last year like the middle of last year so i'm like needs to get done but talk for 15 minutes i should probably shut up now um, but yeah, I appreciate everybody, whether you listen to my music, whether you watch my videos, any of my videos, to be honest, I mean, I prefer people to watch my main channel videos, but honestly, at this point, if you watch my stuff in general, just thank you. I know that for me personally, I don't see like my community as like a big community because it's really not in the grand scheme of things, but I think I always forget that it is still a community of really great people that I very much respect because respect is given like throughout this community and it makes me so happy that <laughs> i almost cried over about this after like the whole josh fight thing where i got a lot more discord members it's like i almost started crying because i'm like dang it's like it's really true that like you gain the audience that you represent kind of thing where it's like i am very much chill for the most part i am try to be respectful of everybody i'm not some loud mouth on the internet i try to be very introspective and very genuine and very like <clears throat> respectful in general so and i'm glad the discord server and the community just reflects that so it makes me very happy whenever i've talked to anybody in my discord server it's always a fun chill time and i don't know it's just a positive energy because you know i'm not a negative nancy i don't try to be <clears throat> and my content's very positive so i'm glad the community reflects that so but yeah Basically, work-life balance is important and toxic productivity is bad. And learning that balance, because right now, my balance is more on the personal side due to Lauren being home and me trying to get back into my own creative things. It's important to have that balance. And right now, my balance is shifted towards more personal stuff because that's where I'm at. Especially because when you're trying to plan a wedding, bruh, it's... <laughs> Is there's a lot that needs to get done um, with that as well. So, so I'm leaning more towards the personal side, but I will be working in the shadows because that's what I like to do. I like to, to disappear, then come back with a banger of a video uh, because it, it it brings me a lot of satisfaction um, to see like a year's work worth of work finally be published. So I'm excited, um, but it'll just take a long time. Unless, for some miracle, I get it done before September. <laughs> I don't know. I just I just need to work on it. But I'm not in, like, that, that mode right now, right? And I need to get back into that mode. So, just be patient with me. I will get to it. But, yeah. I just, I just need to learn a new work-life balance. Because since Lauren's in town, now it's like, oh, I want to hang out with her all the time. Because I never got used to because she was always in college. So, it's like... I gotta learn that work-life balance again, so it'll take a bit, but I'll get it. So thank you for listening. Appreciate you streaming this weekend on this channel. So oh, 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 one last thing, one last thing. I just remembered. In July will be my five-year anniversary on YouTube, and I will stream on the main channel. 
Uh, so that'll be a stream on the main channel in July. So like in two months, I'm excited for that. That's going to be a lot of fun. I have no clue what I'm going to do on that stream. Honestly, I kind of want to just hang out and see what happens, to be honest, because I think it could be fun. Maybe reminisce a little bit. Maybe get some friends in VC. Stuff like, excuse me, stuff like that. I think that's it. So, yeah, I think that's it. Join the Discord server if you haven't yet. I'm active there literally every day, um, streaming once a week on this channel. And yeah, I think that's it. So thank you. I don't know if I'm going to edit this. I should. Will I? I don't know, to be honest. I, I probably will. But um, yeah, toxic productivity is not good. Work-life balance is important.